the next, I will show you how to use NT750 and NT100 software. First, we hit the SD card in our kit and insert the SD card into the computer. Copy the content of the 010203 folder of our SD card to the computer and save it as a backup. After saving, open our 01 folder, find our installer. Double click to open our installer and execute the installer. Click next to select the appropriate installation file directory. The first thing to note is that the installation directory must be in Chinese. The first thing to notice is our installation directory cannot have a Chinese name, must be expressed in letters or English. After selecting the installation directory, click install and wait for the installation to complete. Open for the first time. Our software will be displayed in Chinese or English. If you need to change its English display, we need to go to Settings. Click on General Settings. Choose Language. After selecting the appropriate language, delete the previous language. Restart our software to complete a language change. When opening the software for the first time, because our software, it has been installed in our current computer, so it will have some configuration inside by default. If installing for the first time, it will have a user agreement. Just click to agree. After agreeing, since our software is open for the first time, it does not have a model for us to choose, so it will have a pop-up. In our pop-up box, choose our NT NT750 Rajuo dual head or NT1000 dual double head or choose the dual single head of NT750. Make a corresponding choice according to your model. Now check NT750 dual as an example. After selecting, click add. Our device will automatically add. The molding area of our NT750 equipment. Our forming practical area, as shown in the figure. Completed the addition of our device models. Let's see then, an overview of our entire software. At the top left of our software, have our files, where our projects, and the content of some project columns such as edit and asset, can do some basic operations. Below it is our entity preview mode. And pass preview mode after slicing is done. Usually after slicing. For our print pass. Can be previewed. The words below are our files to open. And our model selection. And our materials. But usually the material does not need to be switched. Of course if we need. It is also possible to change the color display of the material. Select the corresponding material color. In normal conditions, the one we use the most is the one on our right. Selection of configuration parameters. In our new facility, the configuration parameters are only some of its original basic configuration parameters. Then these configuration parameters. It may not be suitable to we can click on our management configuration parameters under it. Then, in the manage configuration parameters section, choose our import. After choosing to import, the same is to find our SD card. In the 0 to folder of the SD card, find the print configuration parameters of the project with random distribution. Click to open. After a successful import, we can see the configuration parameters of our PLA at this location. When we need to print, when we need to slice, we only need to configure the parameter column. Select the parameter file in our custom configuration parameters. After selection, we can see the names of our configuration parameters.
We can see the names of our configuration parameters of our PLA suitable for our large machine equipment. Below is a detailed list of our parameters. When we finish selecting configuration parameters, this detailed list has been completed replacing. No need for us to set up again if we need to fine tune or change the parameters. Then we can open this project bar to make independent changes. If there are some parameters that are not displayed, we can also check the settings by clicking the item bar. When we check the box, he will display under it. We can also see that it's view mode. We can switch UR model from our different. Then when we import a model to view, we can see that. For example, if we open a model, open the model as shown. When our model is imported, we can see that. After selecting the model, to edit the edit bar below. If no model is selected, it is uncheckable mode. It can be seen that it has moved and zoom. Also rotate and mirror. And special printing modes. In special mode, can have a support intercept, support interception. When we do not need to print supports for some parts, we can place the gray box of the support interception. Block out our red support generation area. Supports in this area will no longer be generated. If the support area is too small, we can enlarge it. As shown in the picture, the rest of our red areas are support generating. And this place, because we masked the red area, so it won't have support generated. Explain the general settings. Basic settings. Let's take a look at how we do the normal slicing process. The first step is to import our model into, as we just saw, click import model from the top left, or drag our model directly into the software box. After our model is imported, it is placed by means of rotation and after placing it, it is time to consider whether we need support generation. If not needed, we can use support interceptor. This is the support interceptor below us. After generating the support interceptor, intercept support in the designated area of our model. After editing the model, then go to the second step. Choice of our parameters. That is us. A parameter of PLA suitable for use in our large equipment. After selection, select the third step to slice. After the slicing is completed, save the base code format we got. Then go to our device to run and print. Just save our file. If we need to observe the slice effect of our software, we can click to preview or select preview on the top right of our device. Then we can see, because we just intercepted the support at this position. So this position does not generate support. You can see the difference from his position. The same goes for other locations. If we don't want it to generate support, we can intercept it directly. After the observation, there is no abnormality. We can click Save. Save our file to our designated folder. After saving the SD card, plug into our device. Run this file to start our printing. 